So we make a true bolt action upper for your AR pattern guns. Personally, I like it. I like it better than the automatic. The bolt is fabulous. The gun itself overall, it's a winner. It is. I had nothing bad to say about it. I, mean, I like the gun because you have the ergonomics in the, like an AR-15, but yet you have the control and the precision of a bolt-fed gun. So it was really clean, it stayed on target. No, the recoil was really light too. I mean, at 500 yards, being able to spot the gun, I can see exactly what I get every time. Uh, I would say the accuracy because I was hitting it at 500 yards with 30 mile an hour winds. <laughs> That's a nice rifle. I, uh, I really like the... Uh, Molding of the of the traditional AR lower and that bolt upper, it has a nice feel to it. It's a good shooter. It felt good to shoot. The bolt was, was smooth for something that's effectively just bolted onto a regular AR lower. Yeah, commonality of magazines, calibers, uh, the option to be able to mix and match. I mean, that's great. I think uh, you know folks who have have those AR lowers and are looking at doing something different as an upper, maybe wanting to to have. A, a more precision bolt upper that they can you know, have that flexibility, and uh, I, I would definitely recommend it. I was shooting the Valkyrie bolt action on an AR, really smooth, really good. No, I like the the um, Spike Creed more because it gives you a nice hunting option on your AR-10 platform, and the racking, I mean, it cycles very quick. For hunting, you don't need a semi-auto. It gives you more accuracy in the gun, so it lets you do some nice PRS shooting. More accurate than the gas gun. I didn't realize that you could put a bolt action upper onto a standard receiver. That was cool. Yeah, that was super neat and just felt like a normal AR. It was great. Well, you didn't have a precision rifle. I got to shoot it for the first time today. It was pretty awesome. It had a good trigger on it. Um, it was nice action design on it. I shot the 224 Mile 3 today. Down to 500 yards with about a 20 mile an hour wind and uh, it was hitting right in there shot really nice definitely something you need to check out because the accuracy potential looked like it was something that everybody would want okay well this is my first time having a chance to check it out and look at it uh, i was interested to see what the bolt flow was going to feel like as far as your uh initial extraction uh a lot smoother than i expected the bolt flow is actually really smooth on it very smooth shooting gun, mild recoil. It's got a three lug bolt. And I wasn't sure what the rotation was going to be like uh, on a traditional, we'll say, a Mauser style action with a 93 bolt rotation. Uh, your initial upward push can be on the stiff side. You don't have that on this particular design. It's very smooth, very quick. Looks like it would be an interesting offering in both your small frame and your large frame uh, ARs. I like the fact that uh, they offer. Of the uh, interest in having a chance to do an in-depth review on it in the future.